What's up to all my beautiful and powerful Scorpios? I hope all of you guys out there are doing freaking amazing. Okay, so this is going to be a twin flame reading. I already got some cards. I meditated and pre-shuffled through your cards. So let's get into this energy and see what's popping, Scorpio. Okay, so the first song that came out was Broken Hearted by Brandy. And then we have Shantae Moore. Shantae has a man. So I feel like, Scorpio, by these two cards, I feel like your twin is going to be broken hearted or this person is already broken hearted. Why, Scorpio? Because you got a man. <laughs> okay? So some of you guys, hey, if you haven't met that person yet, don't worry, she coming. You know, you ain't been hearing these same messages for, you know, no apparent reason. So I feel like you guys, when you get ready to meet someone, because I feel like some of you guys, y'all kind of like over this journey, you've, you've let your twin go, you surrender to this connection. It's like you're just ready for something new. So for those of you guys that are going to get somebody new, your twin is going to be broken hearted because you got a man. And then for some of you guys, your twin is going to be broken hearted because they think you're dealing with someone else because why you ain't fucking with them, okay? So we have the energy of this overall, of how your twin is feeling, and we have fear and guilty as charged. So I feel like right now your twin is fearing. For some of you guys, if you have not found someone, or if you're not in a relationship or dealing with someone right now, your twin is fearing that you are. They're liking this energy of fear because they feel like just because you're not fucking with them, that you got to be fucking with somebody else. And then guilty is charged. So if you have accused your twin, you know, of doing something or asking them questions and this person you feel like was lying or wasn't telling you the truth and maybe didn't tell you the whole truth, Spirit is saying that person guilty is charged. Whatever you've assumed, whatever you question, yes, this person is guilty of all that shit, Scorpio. Then we have hidden agenda. So, with this card, Scorpio, I feel like for some of you guys, because y'all know this retrograde, you're going to be hearing me say a lot about that because, hey, that's what it is. So during this period of retrograde or sometime after retrograde and shadow period, I feel like some of you guys, your twin is going to reach out. But I feel like this person is not going to absolutely tell you. The, so for some of you guys, they may tell you the whole truth. And then for some of you guys, they may, may not. But I feel like your twin is going to have some type of hidden agenda. Like if your twin reaches out to you or wants to talk or something, like it's, it's some type of hidden agenda they have. Like... They're going to make it seem like they want to tell you the truth or tell you some type of truth or just want to talk. But it's something else this person has has planned. Then we have, I don't want to change. So if your twin comes in talking that good shit, talking about how they learned their lessons and how they want to change, like it's up to you to use your own intuition, Scorpio, because, you know, I don't know everybody's twin like that. But it's like you have to use your intuition to decide whether this person is being honest or not. Because for some of you guys, this person really doesn't want to change. But I feel like this person understands and they know in order to get back with you or in order to fuck with you again, whatever it is, this person has to present themselves like they've changed. So I feel like for some of you guys, this person really doesn't want to change because they're comfortable with the fucking person that they are. Like, Spirit is having a hard time getting this person changed. So if this person comes in telling you that they've changed and all this good shit, it's like, Scorpio, it's going to be up to you to use your intuition to decide has this person really changed. But this person wants you to know if they do care. This came out earlier. So for a lot of you guys, your twin really does care about you. And I feel like during this period, if you guys are separated or not talking like you used to, you know, this person's realizing how much they do care for you. Then we have, I don't want to keep you a secret, but we have a lot of haters. So for some of you guys, Scorpio, if you felt like maybe your twin was keeping you a secret or maybe now that you guys are maybe on a on a different level here. It's like your twin is doing it because really y'all have a lot of haters. You know what I'm saying? Y'all have a lot. Cause you know, think about it on this twin flame journey. When you and your twin reunite and actually, you know, come together and heal each other. It's like the love that you and your twin had. It's going to be people that's going to be jealous of that Scorpio. Cause everybody don't have that love. It's a lot of people. I ain't going to say everybody. It's a lot of fucking people that will never get to experience that love that you're going to experience with your twin. So the way that this person talks to you, to other people about you guys, you know, they have people that's jealous of them or of you as well because they never had, their friends haven't had anybody that they love like that and your friends either. So your twin is not keeping you a secret, but they don't want problems. They don't want outside people, other third parties to be uh, interference in this connection because it took you guys so long to get back together, okay? 
Let's pull one more card and we're gonna see what this karmic has to say. And then we have keep it on the hush. Yeah, so I feel like for some of you guys, when your twin comes back, they're gonna kinda wanna be hush hush about this shit. And I feel like some of you guys do not get offended. It's not because your person is ashamed of you or they don't want anyone to know that they're involved in you. I feel like a lot of it's gonna have to do with this damn karmic because you don't know how that shit is gonna end. You know, how their situation ended. And then they had jealous people and friends around them. They know people going to be hating and trying to possibly fuck up this connection. This is something that this person does not want because it took them so long, you know, to get to this point. So, for some of you guys, yes, your twin did want to keep you on the hush because they were dealing with other people. But I feel like for some of you guys, they're going to want to keep this shit on the hush because y'all got a lot of haters, okay? What message do you have for my Scorpio today? Let's see what this karma is talking about. Okay, we don't want anyone to know we're separated. So, during the time that your twin and this karma was separated, I feel like this person was still, I feel like both of them, they were still leading on that facade, like they were still together. So, they probably still was, you know, together at holidays. They still attended family functions. It was like they was putting up that front, like they were still together because neither one of them, I feel like, wanted anyone to know, especially your twin. I feel like your twin was more embarrassed than anything because I feel like people looked at, your twin and their relationship or marriage or whatever, like, you know, those were dream goals. You know, like, they were couple goals. There you go, spirit. You know, that for everyone else, and it's like, now they're separated, everybody like, well, damn, what am I supposed to do? Then we have, I guess my spell work didn't work this time. Oh, shit. Okay, so, Scorpio, your karma could have been putting, like, a love spell or something. Like, your twin could have been in some type of days. If y'all feel like y'all twin was just walking around here, zooted or... You know, on another fucking planet, it could have been because they were under some type of spell when it came to this karmic. So, I feel like this karmic tried to keep this person stuck or tried to make an illusion for your twin so they wouldn't come towards you guys. What else does this karmic have to say, spirit? We have history together. So, this karmic feels like just because maybe you and your, your twin and them have, you know, been together for a long time, they have a lot of history. Like, there's something to... Keep them together, no? And let me say this too, Scorpio. Even if you got friends that you got history with, so what? History don't mean shit. You know, it depends on how a person is treating you. You are not the only person they were dealing with. So this karmic wants you to know this karmic hating too. That's what I said. That's why this person wants to keep this on the hush. Because this karmic going to be hating. There's other people that's going to be hating in this relationship, Scorpio. That's all I have, you guys. Please like, share, and subscribe.